Here you have your manure alternative all-in-one grow kit that you've acquired from freshoffthecap.com. You've injected this with your choice of spores or liquid culture. You've waited now until the mycelium has consumed about a third of the kit, crushed it all up, patted it back down into a block, and now you have these little white dots growing in your kit, and these are something called primordia. This is a sign that your mushrooms will start wanting to grow very, very soon. And maybe you've seen this for about a week or two weeks now and nothing's starting to really grow. So your mushroom wants some more fresh air. So you can either do this inside of a plastic tote or a plastic bag, and you're going to need some isopropyl alcohol and a spray bottle filled with water. If you're using an old tote or an old bag, make sure you rinse it out with water first to remove any debris and then go ahead and start cleaning. If you're doing this on top of a wooden countertop like I did, you may get alcohol stains. So to remedy this, you can get any kind of cooking oil and rub it into those stains and it'll be removed. Make sure you're cleaning up every nick and cranny with alcohol as we want to be sure our tote or our bag is very nice and clean. Next, we're gonna go ahead and spray down our grow kit as well. And go ahead and grab yourself a pair of scissors or a knife and cut off this top half of the bag. And you could place this kit like this into a tote. However, you may develop side pins, which are very difficult to harvest. So instead, on the sides, we're gonna place, make two cuts on each side, just as so. And through this whole process here, you wanna make sure you have clean hands. Doing this, we're going to try to avoid touching the substrate, but if you do, it's no big deal. The mycelium has already consumed all the nutrients here and your hands are clean. Go ahead and get your water bottle and spray down the sides of your tote here. You don't want any pooling, but you do wanna spray this down once a day. Go ahead and grab your lid and place this upside down on your tote. This way we can allow for some fresh air. And if yours closes shut like mine did, then you can prop it up on the side just like that. So here's an example of what it looks like inside of a bag. So clean it out with 70% isopropyl alcohol, just like so. And you can remove the all-in-one kit bag or just fold it up underneath the substrate itself. And go ahead and spray down the side walls with water. And then fold the top bag like so and you're good to go. Freshoffthecap.com for your mushroom growing needs. Much love.